Alright, so in Lyrical we have this thing called the Cypher. Well, actually, I'm going to explain it when I do my last piece. Never mind. Let me back up. Alright, so I use that piece to kind of recalibrate. I got four more pieces for y'all. Y'all good? Yes. Alright, 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 alright. We're going to get back into some more stuff. Here we go. He watched. His friends as they galloped across the laps of virgins, popping the cherries of anemic intellects, their language served as blood clots. Filling the ears of female counterparts with acid velvet charm, their legs opened at hello but never at goodbye. Adolescent skin thighs enjoying a pleasure their nostrils couldn't take. This love was fake, dipped in lies derived from a Drake mixtape. The guys were only doing what the sound wave said they should. They said they should undress women with their words, undress women with their eyes, undress women with their hands, then dress their thoughts with their own long tees. They clothed both sides of the conversation. There was no rebuttal. Only pregnancies earmarked by birth certificates, blanketed by blanks. She had to sign her name twice. No husband, just wife. Married to a birth, she didn't know there was such a thing as a one-way proposal. So he watched. His friends never missing a beat, even as their seeds fill the streets with cries in a language only daddy can understand. That little boy needed to be a man, but he doesn't know that he can because the blood running through him is stunted. His father jumped through hoops to get lips loose, but when it came time to man up, he shut up. Revealing that his manhood was only an organ. with y'all, I need to say either thank you or I'm done, because this step back isn't working. Y'all are like, wait, wait, wait. But that's cool.